Hey, what is going on guys? My name's Long Sensation and stay with God for you guys is some more Call of Duty Black Ops 3 gameplay. Now in today's video I will indeed be showing off the Diamond LMGs within Black Ops 3 multiplayer and this was by far the hardest challenge I've got to do up to date. In fact, I have got another video coming out tomorrow, hopefully, in which I'll be showing off the diamond shotguns, and that was by far the worst one so far. The Brecky shotgun is just unbelievably hard to do. But let's just show off the weapons in the pre-game like we did last time. We're just going to show off the diamond weapons. Here's the Gordon. It looks pretty cool. I always call it the Gordon instead of the Gorgon for some reason, a little joke between me and my friends. That definitely looks pretty cool. We'll now move on to uh, the 48 Dredge. This one was pretty difficult to do. In fact, it was surprisingly easy to get the headshots. If you want a little tip with this weapon, all you need to do is aim center mass. The recoil of the six rounds will actually cause the weapon to go upwards and then will actually hit people in the head. So that's just a little tip if you guys are struggling with that one. The dingo looks pretty cool. I love the little uh, golden kind of uh, accents on the magazine. That looks very nice indeed. I always like the golden accents a lot more. And finally, here's the BRM. And uh, yeah, I like the golden accents more on the uh, AN44, is it called? Let's just quickly take a look. I'm not sure why, or the KM44, should I say. I always liked the golden accents, like look at the magazine and look at the stock and the grip. It just looks very cool and I am slightly disappointed by Diamond Camo. I'm not particularly bothered that it is like this. A lot of people have been complaining that it looks uh, terrible and stuff like that. But me personally, I'm not too fussed. I just want to get this Dark Matter Camo, uh, which hopefully I'll be bringing you guys sometime early next week. It just depends on uh, getting the uh, pistols done, getting the knife done, getting... Uh, what else have I got to do? The snipers, which are going to be incredibly difficult because I'm not a sniper person. But the launches are nearly done. I've just got to take out two sentry guns and then I will hopefully be able to bring it to you guys. So I'm just going to quickly skip this pre-game lobby and I'll be back with you guys in just a second. Alright, so we are now back. We are indeed in hardcore to give you a bit of a better look at the weapons. The first one is the 48 Dredge. I do like this, but I would just like to see some more of that golden accent that I was talking about on the assault rifle, just on these black parts, like, I'm not really sure why they've not done that in terms of, you know, putting it all gold or all diamond, but it kind of looks a little bit stupid when you've got things like that on it. Same with this uh, uh, dingo here is that I would like to see the stock at the front of the gun, like to the left there, as you can see the golden accent. It looks uh, pretty cool in my opinion. And this was the hardest LMG to do. It was uh, surprisingly difficult actually, uh, you know, actually getting it done because I I'm not sure, it was just a hit marker machine in my opinion. The recoil was a little bit stupid, uh, but I, I managed to get it done obviously. And uh, next up we have the Gorgon, which is highly controversial at the moment within uh, the Call of Duty Black Ops 3 community obviously because uh, people are just saying it's far too overpowered. It's kind of like... Uh, to hit kill anywhere across the map and it's just a bit annoying when you're coming up against a team that are using just solely the Gorgon uh, in my opinion anyway, but finally we now have the BRM. This one was pretty easy to do uh, Kind of a nice recall pattern kind of very accurate and uh, the 48 dredge by the way If you want to get that gold straight away just aim for the chest the upwards pattern of the recoil will actually cause you to get a headshot like I was saying before that was that was by far my greatest tip that I can give you guys. But that is going to be pretty much it for the Diamond LMGs. I will have the Diamond Shotguns for you guys tomorrow, hopefully. And then shortly after that, I should have the pistols and then the launchers. And then the next up will possibly be the knife. And uh, finally, I will do the SMGs and the snipers. And then we will get the super rare Dark Matter camo in which you've got to get all of your weapons diamond. But that is going to be pretty much it from me, guys. I've been Long Cessation. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video.